The treacherous body of water known as the Florida Straits is the holy grail for marathon swimmers, and Diana Nyad wanted to conquer swimming it unassisted. So, 53 hours after setting off from Havana on Saturday, Nyad was able to check mark that box off her bucket list. Braving dangerous currents, poisonous jellyfish, dehydration, and exhaustion, Nyad completed the 177 kilometer swim. She has now set the world record for the longest unassisted open ocean swim. This means she used no shark cage or bodysuit to protect her and no flippers to assist her. Hundreds of well-wishers greeted her, snapping up photos and cheering as she staggered ashore in the Florida Keys. Even with a sunburned face and swollen lips, Nyad uttered three important messages. One is, we should never ever give up. <laughs> Okay. Two is, you're never oh, too old to chase your dreams. That's right. Three is, it looks like a solitary sport, but it's a team. Uh. <laughs> this crew member said Nyad's first night was the hardest, but her burning spirit carried her through. She came through that and was really strong. She had it physically, she had it emotionally. Yes, setting this world record is incredible, but what makes Nyad remarkable is her perseverance. She first made a go of this same swim at age 28 in 1978. And over the past 35 years, she tried and failed three more attempts. One of Nyad's friends who accompanied her on all five swims said she always had faith Diana would realize her lifelong dream. We've always known that Diana could do it. We've always known that. I knew that in 1978. All you have to do is know her to know that she could swim from Cuba to Florida if the waters were glassy, if the weather was right, if there were no beasts. In the end, this 64-year-old senior faced those beasts and conquered every obstacle. She proved that when it comes to following your dreams, age and gender don't matter one bit. Sonia Artero, TVB News.